Hey everyone, this is Derek here, and if you clicked onto this video, then you're probably interested in learning how to use screen recording on your iPhone or iPad. So for those of you who don't know, screen recording with and without audio is actually built into iOS 11, and that's pretty cool, but it's not enabled by default. So first we have to enable it, and uh, by doing that, we are going to put a button on our control center that we can use to start and stop screen recording. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into settings. So this is an iPad. We'll use this first, and then I'll show you on my iPhone. So with the iPad, you have to go to Control Center, and then you want to go to Customize Controls and find Screen Recording. So here it is, a little red button. So we're going to tap the plus there to add it to our Control Center, and now we're going to go back to the home screen, just like that. Now we'll bring up our Control Center by swiping up from the bottom of the screen, like so. And then you can see this button here, and this button looks very similar. It's white instead of red, but it's very similar to the button that we saw in the settings app. So this is how you enable and disable screen recording. And if you want to use audio, so say you're recording some gameplay footage for um, PUBG Mobile, like I'll be doing in a little bit, then you probably want audio. And if you're uh, just recording something else like... Uh, like a text message or uh, you know sketching up a photo or something like that, then you probably don't want audio. So in order to select whether you want audio or not, you want to press down and hold here. And if you have 3D Touch, it's a 3D Touch, um, but this is an iPad mini, so this doesn't have 3D Touch, so you just press and hold. And you can choose where you want to save your recording. So on I have Facebook installed, so um, it could do it there or a camera roll. And then here is your your setting for audio. So right now, microphone audio is off. If we want to turn that on, we just tap that. So in order to actually start recording, see it says everything on your screen, including notifications, will be recorded. So they say do not uh, or use do not disturb if you don't want uh, notifications popping up during your recording. So that's something to keep in mind. So to start a recording, we just go like that, and we are now. There's a countdown. Now we are recording our screen. And we're also recording our audio. So now what we'll do is we'll just go back to the, uh, the home screen here. And you can see in the status bar or the notification bar up here that there is a red bar. And that's to let you know that screen recording is active. And this is something that you can't turn off because they don't want you to forget that you are recording your screen. But if you're uh, using this footage in certain apps or if you, you, know, you want to upload it to YouTube, say, some, uh, some gameplay footage, you can crop that out. So now let's say we're done with our recording and we want to, um, to finish that. You know, so in order to end the recording, we go back to our control center here as I move around the tripod. And we're going to uh, tap this again. Just like that, it says screen recording video saved to photos. And we're done. So that is pretty much how you set up screen recording in iOS 11 on the iPad. And uh, now we'll go to the iPhone. It's a very, very similar experience, but I want to show you both ways. Uh, that way this video can serve as a uh, good reference for whatever Apple product you may have. All right, so now we're in the settings app on my iPhone 10, and it's very, very much the same as what we did with the, I with the iPad. We're going to go first to Control Center, and then we want to go to Customize Controls. And you can see here are the current ones, the defaults, and we're going to go down here and find screen recording. Again, you know, red circle. We're going to add that to the control center. And then what we'll do is we'll go back to the home screen. All right, so now that we're on the home screen, let's say we want to record some video for, again, a gameplay footage. So what we'll do now is we'll access the control center. On the iPhone 10. you have to slide down or swipe down from the top right. And you can see a new button here. So this wasn't here before, and this is the screen recording option. So very similar to the iPad, if you want to, you can record with or without audio. And if you want to record with or without audio, you have to set that before you begin. So by tapping and holding, you get the option to save it to either your camera roll, which is default, or Facebook. And then if you want your audio off or on, you can select that here. So red is on, black is off. And if you want to start recording, Let's say we want to record without the microphone audio on. We'll just click start. There's a countdown. And as soon as it starts recording, you can see it is counting up now. You can see this is pulsing. 
And now if you go back up, just like that, not the best example, but it works. <laughs> Not the smoothest. You can see here that there is a red. So let's see if that's in frame. Move that down a little bit. You can see that the uh, clock is red and pulsing, and that lets you know that screen recording is currently active. So anything we do on the screen is being recorded. And say you want to finish the, the screen recording. So very similar to the iPad, what you do is you drag down into Control Center again, and then you just tap this. Just like that, screen recording video, save to photos, and you're done. So hopefully this, uh, this video helped you out in uh, figuring out how to set up screen recording. And you can also go into the settings app if you want to and customize your control panel if you want to move that screen recording button around uh, to make it easier to access. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, definitely give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel for more awesome tech stuff.